The Boston Consulting Group Matrix shows whether a firm has a balanced portfolio of products or divisions. The model incorporates the concept of the product life cycle and places products or divisions in a grid. Using this grid to assess the profitability of each product or division based on their market growth and market share. The organization can then develop strategies and targets for control and performance management purposes. For example, should an organization grow, hold, harvest or divest a product or division. Market growth is a percentage increase or decrease in the annual market revenue. Relative market share is divisional market share in comparison to the overall market or the leading competitor. A product may start out as a question mark. These products have a relatively low market share of a high growth market. Often question marks are new products and large investment is required in order to grow the business. Question marks produce a moderate to negative cash flow and the organization needs to develop strategies to either invest or divest in the product. The questions to ask are, is the product gaining market share? How effectively is the product being advertised? What contribution would be received if an organization decided to divest? If divesting, should this be done quickly or slowly? With investment, a question mark may become a star. A star has a large relative market share of a high growth market. With stars, the market is still growing, competition is not yet fully established, demand is strong and market saturation and oversupply is not an issue. Manufacturing overheads are minimised due to high volumes and good economies of scales. Stars still require a large amount of investment to hold or build on their current market share and only produce a moderate cash flow for the business. The question an organization should be asking, is the high investment being used effectively? That is, is the market share being gained or eroded? What is the customer's perception of the product? Are critical success factors changing as the market grows? What is the net cash flow? A star may become a cash cow. A cash cow has a large market share of a low growth market. Cash cows are cash generators which require little investment. Activities to support products in this quadrant should be aimed at maintaining and protecting their existing position, together with good cost management, rather than aimed at growth. This is because there is little likelihood of additional growth being achieved. The questions an organisation need to ask here is, what is the cash net flows? Is the market share being eroded? Cash cows can be used to fund other investments such as question marks and stars. And finally, dogs. Dogs have a small share of a low growth market. They produce moderate or negative cash flows and an organisation should be considering to divest here. The questions to ask is, should the organisation divest slowly or quickly? Is the market likely to grow, which may justify retaining the product? The Boston Consulting Group matrix can be used by an organization to ensure an organization has a balanced portfolio of products or divisions. For example, are there enough cash cows to fund question marks and stars? The drawbacks of the matrix is that it's very simplistic in nature. It doesn't measure profit or cost control. The Boston Consulting Group matrix should only be used as a starting point for performance management.